Hey guys, it's Joshua Stern with Keller Williams Real Estate and the High Performance Coaching Group I affectionately call the Utah Roost. This is our second part in the lead generation series, the second leg of the bench, if you will. If you haven't listened to the part one, please go back and take a listen to that. Um, this particular uh, segment, we're going to focus on um, doing self-generated leads, right? So here's the thing. We know that lead generation, it comes first, it comes last, and it comes always. The experts tell us to master the morning, practice our conversions, that conversations rather, that convert and hit the phones to make contacts and do all of this before noon. They tell us 30 contacts a day or more, five days a week. Now, I get it. No one wants to do this. But if we go back and we look at that 36 touch system, we're only making four calls per year to each person that we know. And each of those calls are worth $300 a piece, right? Remember that each person we market to using that eight by eight and 36 touch system is worth $1,200. So if you're making four phone calls per year to those people, that's $300 per phone call. Um, this is a numbers game that I played with myself because I also didn't love making phone calls. Coincidentally, I liked making phone calls to people I knew even less than making phone calls to strangers. So I had to put some numbers to the contacts. And man, did that help me get through the reality that to succeed, I had to dial. So each day from nine to 12, I do my lead generation and my lead follow-up. I'd call my SOI and those people that were in my eight by eight. All right. And then I'd look for ways to create have mets, right? Feeding that database that we're talking about. That's that self-generated uh, leg of the bench, right? Who am I calling? I might be doing expired calls. I might be calling around just listed properties or just sold properties. We call those circle calls. Um, and I loved, by the way, calling around open houses and inviting the neighbors to open house. Boy, did I add a lot of people to my database, right? Um, I, and I, I basically line up those open houses to occur on Saturdays and Sundays, okay? So I found the combination of these different types of lead generation sources would take me to my contact goal of 30, usually within about two to three hours. Um, and I would also set myself a database addition goal in addition to an appointment goal, right? I started tracking these, uh, these data points during the Great Recession, and that was upon my coach's suggestion. And after six months of tracking, what I found is that 30 contacts would lead to two database additions and one appointment. Now, the best part of all of this is that it didn't go, I, I didn't personally go broke uh, buying low hanging leads while other agents were bankrupting themselves out of the business. Think about how much money it costs right now to generate a Zillow lead or a realtor.com lead. It's just enormous, right? And how many people do you have competing for those same leads? It's, it's, it's awful, right? I was prospering and selling more than 100 homes a year during the Great Recession with one other agent and one admin. It's simple, but it's not easy, and I recognize that. On the Utah Roost, we've decided that we all do our prospecting together. The synergy blocks the suffering, and it actually makes it fun. And we laugh when we get hung up on, and we ask questions from others when we get stumped. The juice is worth the squeeze. Each person that we're adding to the database is $1,200. Adding two people a day is $2,400 a day. Not bad, right? I know it sounds crazy, but if you feed a database like this daily, and then you follow the eight by eight, which is the eight touches in eight weeks, and that followed up with a 36 touch system, you're gonna find yourself with a black belt career in real estate. And after doing this for two years, you'll have more business than you can service on your own. Trust me, I know. The first year I was in real estate, I did 27 transactions. The second year I was in real estate, I did 48 transactions just by feeding this database. So if you'd like to learn a little bit more about what we've already done for you, send us an email to realtor at utahroost.com.